Servus Freunde, my name is Jimmy Cage and these are my top 10 movies with awesome dogs. Number 1. Patterson. Get my ass kicked today. What are you playing? Myself. Well, okay, that list still has to wait. Patterson is a movie about a guy named Patterson who lives in the New Jersey town of Patterson. If you're looking for a movie with a strong narrative that's story-driven and constantly moving forward to some kind of goal, you probably won't be that happy with Jim Jarmusch's newest film Patterson. But if you are looking for peculiar characters and just a celebration of life or of simply being, this might surprise you in a wonderful way. I had the best time with Patterson. So let's see what the movie is actually about. Patterson, played by Adam Driver, is a bus driver and also a poet. Each day, shortly after six, he wakes up, kisses his lovely girlfriend, eats his cereal and begins his daily road as a bus driver. Morning, Donnie. Everything okay? No, not really. My kid needs braces on her teeth. My car needs a transmission job. My wife wants me to take her to Florida, but I'm behind on the mortgage payments. My uncle called from India and he needs money for my niece's wedding and I got this strange rash on my back. How about you? I'm okay. In between times, he writes little poems down in his notebook. Just things that come to his mind, for example, about a box of matches from his home. In the evening, he's eating dinner with his girlfriend Laura, who tells him about her new little plans. And then he goes for a walk with the grumpy bulldog Marvin. He makes a stop at his local pub, drinks exactly one beer and goes back home. And that's pretty much it. That's no movie, you think? Well, it is, and it's wonderful. We follow Patterson around each day. It's basically the same stuff happening day after day. We even start again and again by putting Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday and so forth on the screen. One full week, two hours of screen time in the life of Patterson. It's a movie about life, or rather of being alive. Or of simply being. It's not an adventure story, there's no action, there aren't any world-shaking events, it's dealing with our normal day-to-day -day life, but it also shows you how wondrous that might be, just to be alive, to do the stuff you do, your duties as well as your little pleasures in life. That's what Patterson is about. Like Adam Driver's character Patterson is a poet, the movie itself shows us the poetry of life, with its constant repetitions and also unexpected moments. In our modern world, with the constant stream of information, with our way of being connected to everything at every single moment and the sometimes overwhelming feeling of acceleration, of not being able to catch up with everything around you, this is a marvelous movie. It takes a step back, spends time to enjoy the moment, cherish little things like a random encounter with another person at the laundry and gives you just a good time. If you like filmmaking like this, of course. It's romanticized, especially his girlfriend seems to be very dreamy. It's on the brink of feeling a little bit too whimsical at moments, but it makes up for that by its leaned back, humorous nature. Watching Patterson is fun. All of Jarmusch's character have an interesting note to them and by far my favorite one was the dog Marvin. He's just the best and the way the movie is edited and cuts between Adam Driver and the dog just enhances the humor. I think Patterson is one of Jim Jarmusch's best works and I give it an 8 out of 10. A bus driver in Patterson? Aha! Aha what? This is very poetic. Alright, that's it. Like always, please tell me in the comments below what you think about Patterson. And also please tell me what's your favorite movie by Jim Jarmusch. You can hit me up on Twitter, Facebook and Instagram simply at the Jimmy Cage. And if you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up, share, subscribe, whatever you like. You are not